using a backhoe, CIDG personnel dug up a part of this 50-hectare vacant plot in HDJ Bayawan Tolong Compound in Santa Catalina Negros Oriental, a mill allegedly owned by former Negros Oriental Governor Pride Tevez. This is supposedly the area where witnesses say they were asked to bury ammunition. After digging a 10-feet hole, authorities were able to recover long and short firearms and explosives. The Joint Task Force says the firearms they found in the compound have been buried for quite some time now. These include six rifles, nine pistols, and over 9,000 rounds of live ammunition. Three individuals were also arrested at the meal, two security guards, and one fire truck driver. However, Pride, who is now the president of the company that owns the sugar mill and the subject of the search warrant, was not in the compound during the raid. Pride is the brother of Negros Oriental 3rd District Representative Arnie Tevez, who is being linked to the killing of Governor Roel de Gamo. Aside Aside from the firearms, the CIDG also seized some 18 million pesos in cash from the sugar mill so it can be used as evidence. Ang kanila namang sinabi is um, andun siya sa, sa pinaginala ang crime scene. They, they don't have the interest uh, on the money but they have to account kung mayroon ba itong kinalaman. The evidence seized as well as the three suspects were taken to the CIDG headquarters. But authorities clarify the search warrant does not pertain to the Degamo Slay case but is meant for the seizure of illegal firearms. To dismantle armed groups, those firearms, not licensed firearms, then this could have been also a source of uh, yung, uh, the stability in the area. Kaya kami, as a Joint Task Force Negros, uh, we, we appreciate yung naging uh, ginawa ng CIDG na haluglugin yung area na yon. Pride Davis says though that he only owns 10% of the corporation, which led him to believe that he was the only target of the CIDG. I am the president because most of the stockholders are Manila based and Ako may pinaka-experience sa sugar milling. Meanwhile, the Justice Department is looking at two to three masterminds in the killing of Degamo. Justice Secretary Rimulia says one of the suspected masterminds is Congressman Tevez. Congressman Tevez texted me. I think they're, 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 considered, uh, they're being considered as masterminds, but I don't know yet. Uh, I have to get it from the panel of prosecutors. But uh, right now, the way it's progressing, that's, a, that's the direction we're heading to. Primulia says the DOJ will also call on Pride Tevez to attend the preliminary investigation in relation to the explosives found in the sugar mill. For News 5, Marlene Alcaide, we are One News.